everybody, this is Yelly from Elisa Ravel Stickers. And for those of you that are new, welcome. And for those of you that are not new, welcome back. So um, I got carried away when I was doing my weekly. And let me just go ahead and show you that. So if you have not watched that video, you're going to want to go and watch it because this is such a cute weekly. And I got carried away <laughs> and started using all the stickers for the weekly and my intention was to really use these um, deco kits for it instead of the weekly kit so I only ended up using one strip but I said to myself well I really wanted to show you guys how versatile these kits are and how fun it is to use them so I decided that I was gonna set up my Monday with you guys using the deco kit and I will be using whatever I have left over from this one just because I have it. And um, so the only thing that I would say um, with regard to the deco kits is that these guys here are not big enough to cover this whole area of the Hobonichi planner. However, that being said, it's not like you can't do it either. Um, you just need um, to play around with it a, a bit. I do have um, script stickers for the days of the week and uh, a whole set of numbers from 1 to 31. And there's four sets of uh, weekly uh, scripts. So you could buy one and use it for four deco kits if that's what you want to do. Um, so right now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to wipe everything out because, um, and I'm just going to grab whichever scripts and numbers I have available, um, that are not necessarily going to be the ones that go with these kits just because, um, I, I didn't grab the scripts. <laughs> <laughs> Had I, I should have just thought this better, uh, thought this through a little bit better. And uh, as you can see, I'm trying to figure out where I have my um, weekly scripts. And I don't know if I have any, so I might have to go and grab some. Let me just check and see what it is that I have here. Um, oh, I'm going to put these aside and these as well um yeah I don't think I have that many um I have a whole well these might be able to do because I, it is a 25 so I'll have a 25 here I just need um scripts for days of the week let me see if I have any I know I have a ton in the shop. I'm just not sure about what I have um, back here. So I might just end up grabbing some. Let me see what I have. Yeah, I might just go ahead and do that. And I'm sure that somewhere I do have some. Um, like, this is definitely not the way to start this video. Okay, so I went and grabbed it. <laughs> I don't know how many of these I've, I've grabbed and then I've lost so um, but it's okay um, that way I can show you exactly um, how to get how to um, make these work so we said it's Monday the 25th so let me just um, get that in here so there's a different ways that I can do this if I want to go ahead and use these guys I can kind of set a corner here or I can just use the corner down here somewhere like there's many ways that you can kind of um, work with this and what I'm gonna do right now is I'm just gonna grab this sticker and I'm gonna put like the day hanging out a little bit here and then I'm gonna put the date over here okay and this is how I'm gonna do it now, um, down here, I'm also going to wipe this out just because I do not love, um, 
I mean, I don't even understand what's written in here because I did not get the English version. So of course, this is not something that I'm interested in preserving. I don't even know what it says. So, um, and I'm just gonna go ahead and use this guy over here. So I don't need to like um, get rid of everything on this side because I'm gonna be using this guy. And then um, I'll use some decorations here as well. So let me just draw. I think I put all the rulers away and if not, I don't know what I did with the other ones, so I lost them. But that is okay. Let's just get this line here. Oh, mm, you know what? I have something that's going to be nicer than that line. And uh, I have it right here. So let me use it, right? Let me just go ahead and use these guys. And this is a washi strip. I need to um, make these available also tr in transparent um, paper and like this length so that you could go completely um, top to bottom of the page because right now they are sized for A5 um, width, not length. And we might need them for length, right? So I'm gonna go all the way down just because I can and I'm not using washi down here. So let's just cut it out like so. And I am sure I'll figure out where to use these. So let me just put it on my ruler for now. If you are a person like me that I like to uh, replace these time strips. I also have um, time strips available separately in my shop. And uh, I think they're marked to work with the compact vertical planners, but um, they work great in the Hobonichi ones as well. I just don't know if I took them out and never put them back, which it seems that that's what I did. So, um, I guys, I have a mess. I hate working this way because it's really not comfortable. And then, you know, I just have a lot of mess that I need to sort through every time I'm going to look for something. So, let me see and just figure out how to find them. I, I know they have to be here because I used them recently, so they cannot have gone um, too far away. Oh, look, I had this here. Ah, had I looked here first. Yeah, you know what? I don't know what I did with those um, strips. Hmm. This is so bizarre. Anyway, I found these guys and even though they're not necessarily <clears throat> the exact color that I'm looking for, I'm just going to go ahead and use it just because, I don't know, if you're like me, I do not like the times that the Hobonichi brings. Uh, let me just show you again. It's like tiny, tiny squares and maybe for people that have very petite writing, this is fine, but I don't need it to go till three in the morning, that's for sure. Um, maybe up until nine, my time strips are not quite that long. They go from seven to seven, which is for, uh, okay for most people. I do work till nine some days, but, um, but seven to seven is just perfect. So I'm going to go with that. I'm going to use that. And then, um, I'm going to continue setting up my day. So over here, I also like to set up, um, my Etsy shop and since I'm going with red I'm going to continue with red over here and I'm going to go and use this guy and once I set up I, I like to leave a little bit of space because you'll see for gymnastics I'll go below the seven a little bit just a little bit um, and then I like to set up a, a little section up here for um 
for like my um for um like my morning routine tasks which I am just getting used to so I'm going to be writing them up here in two columns. So let's just go ahead and do that. Um, let me grab my scripts, that same morning routine. And uh, I have one that has a check. So once I'm used to doing my morning routine, I'll go ahead and use the one that has the check mark, which is this one here. But since now I'm kind of let, spelling it out, um, what I'll be doing is something a little bit different. So here, I want to put this on a, um, I should have not put this one down yet. Let's just take this off because I might need to put it down a little bit further. And bear with me, like this is not like super um, smooth planning because it is the first time that I'm adding my morning routine to my pages so um please you know give me some grace because i need it so i am going to continue trying to use like the red tones a little bit more than anything else and uh, i'm gonna set my script over here so now i need to spell out what my morning routine is just so that i have a place to reference this and I am going to go with the smaller dots because it's going to be like an extensive list. And um, I kind of, so let me just start putting it together, right? Um, let me grab all of these colors. I'm going to grab one of each. And then um, I'll see <clears throat> how many more I need. So I like to leave at least a space in between, I'll kind of like so. Okay, so there are some things that I need to do on Etsy. Um, so I need to renew listings. I need to um, edit. There are some listings that I need to edit. So, um, I need to do just like a few each day, but if I do it this way, I, this is something I've been putting off for a year. <laughs> if I do it this way, uh, by the end of three months, I'm gonna be done editing. So if I really keep to it, um, this is something that's gonna go by super fast. So I'm gonna renew, I'm gonna edit. Um, then I am going to update inventory. Um, for my listings and then the amount of listings I'm not writing it down because I'm still trying to figure out what's a reasonable amount since there's so many of these tasks but also I don't want to get lost so maybe I'll do a full page on it see or I'll just do a number and write down where I left off I don't know I need to figure out how I'm going to keep track of what I've done and what's pending uh, but yeah um, these are things that um, need to happen every single day on Etsy. Then the other thing that I always want to do is I want to um, post on Instagram, right? I want to post on Facebook, whether it's my group or any of the other Facebook groups or the Facebook page. So I have to kind of alternate. Um, in between all of these guys and um, and it's okay if I don't do them all as long as I'm doing one or two of these I'm okay and the same goes for um, YouTube short and then there's a day where I'm going to be filming or editing. So those days, it's instead of YouTube short, it's going to be filming or editing. But it's going to be something that's YouTube related. So I'm going to leave it like that for now. I still have space to grow over here. But I do want to mark like the ending of this list somehow. So initially, I was going to go with that pink um, washi. 
but I'm not going to use it right now. What I'm going to do is I'm going to um, just use this guy to kind of divide over here. And um, I have my little ruler over here. Let me just um, get this. Oh my gosh, that was horrible cut. I'll tell you what happened. My husband came downstairs and I think he was on the phone. And I'm here getting stressed out because I'm, I'm listening right to him talk. And I don't want that to come in the video. So then I go ahead and rush the process. And this is what ended up happening. Instead of doing it the right way, I got, you know, anyway, it's okay. I'll figure out a way to cover it and it'll be all good. Let me just put this guy over here. So um, this is my morning routine. So I'm not gonna have like a social media section like I used to. Well, let me say it this way. I'm still gonna have a social media section because from these tasks, there might be some specific tasks that I need to get to. And I made myself these guys that are made on transparent um, stickers so that I can um, just kind of put them down and uh, figure it out, right? And right now I'm just doing Instagram, um, YouTube, and Facebook. So what I'm going to do for this one, I don't know if this is how I'm going to lay them all out, but I'm going to kind of just um, make this this way. And I'm going to leave like a big enough space, a large enough space that um, if I need to put a good amount of tasks, I have the space to do that. Now, let me also use this leftover strip here. And I am going to um, go ahead and um, over here, I'm gonna use this section for my to-dos. And I, I do have some scripts that say to-do. So let me um, just grab one of these because I saw them and I was like, oh, nice. I know that I'm gonna need that. And then um, I have a few ways of doing this. I can either use dots that I have here or like the ones that I have here, or I can just go ahead and um, use a um, one of these guys. I just don't know if there's any ghosting that happens with these. Um, let me just try this out here. Let me try this out over here because I don't remember. I know I, I checked this at some point. Yeah, there's a tiny bit of ghosting, so I'm not gonna use it. Um, and it's definitely not dry, so it's gonna go to the other page. So I'm not gonna use this guy, definitely not. The other thing that I have that I can always use are my, um, these came with the advent calendar for those of you that um, had the advent calendar, but I still have a whole bunch of date dots, uh, a whole bunch of little dots here. So I'm going to go ahead and use these. Um, yep, definitely going to use these. So let's uh, figure out what color to start with. I think I'm going to start with uh, green and then I'm going to do this guy and then the red and then the light pink. And I do have like a few to-dos that are important for me um, to write down. I'm not 100% sure I'm gonna write them down just yet because um, I still need to see what it is that I'm gonna be able, This today is Friday, I'm filming this on Friday. So I need to still be able to see what, what it is that I'm gonna be able, to, I need to be able to see, I can't talk, sorry what it is that I'm gonna be able to do tomorrow, Saturday. And depending on that, I'll fill these in. Same is gonna go with um, Etsy shop tasks. But for my Etsy shop, since I know I won't be able to handle more than um, a few of them, I am gonna go ahead and use these guys. And I think this is gonna look super, super cute. I really like it. And uh, it's just going to give it like um, an extra cuteness 
to it. Now let me find that ruler where I've been putting um, these stickers on just to kind of have them somewhere. So I want to, um, I want to use this one here, which means that I'm going to have to lift this one a little bit, right? But that's okay. I can still um, just have it up until here, right? And cut it off so it still works out. I just kind of want to do that. Wanted to do this. Now I want to have a little bit of fun and I want to decorate. And I'm sorry I'm making this so complicated. Like I feel that I don't know. Um, I don't know if maybe it's not quite my day or what, but I feel that I'm like you know all over the place today. So sorry about that, guys. Let me see. Um, so I think I want to go with this basket down here. And I am just going to go ahead and do like a little strawberry up here. I just want to spread a few decorations around. I'm not going to go too crazy. Um, but there are a few things that I do want to um, kind of, you know, just have here and there. And then I'm just going to put like some berries down here. Like if they kind of fell from the basket, you know. Um, and let me just do another of the tiny ones over here and just kind of play a little bit um, with the berries and then continue on to the pattern here. I think that just looks super cute. And I don't have to go crazy. I don't have to put too much because you guys know that I'm more a functional planner than a um, decorative planner. So this is like a nice mix for me to kind of see that it's becoming something prettier than what I typically do, but not too complicated that it's gonna paralyze me from doing anything. Now, let me go ahead and put my plans um, in here because you guys know that I do have some of those. And let me find my scripts for what I have. It's not too much, but And I am slowly, since I'm not doing the Daily Duo anymore, I'm slowly transitioning to smaller scripts. So once these large scripts are done, I'm going to go ahead and um, do smaller ones. So I need to um, get my carpool stickers as well. Let me just put these over here temporarily. And we also have gymnastics. And this is why there's kind of like different scripts right now. First, I don't think it looks bad. I think it looks actually cute to just have different types of scripts. Now, um, let me grab these stickers. I have like a mess of stickers over here. Let me just get that away from the camera because it's starting to, um, to bother me having that there. Okay, so my therapy session is going to be from 12 to 1 and um, let me just go ahead and put that in over here and then almost right after my therapy session I'm gonna have to go and in, into the carpool hopefully my husband will be able to take my daughter to work on Monday to school on Monday on his way to work and um, We do have gymnastics, so that is something that I also need to add here. Okay, let's um, use my ruler to mark these things. And I'm also gonna go ahead and use this pen because the pen was fine. Um, well, let me just double check. I'm saying it was fine, but I haven't double checked. So let me see. There's no ghosting from the pen. I did use it, so I'm just gonna go ahead and use it here again. I need a pencil board, you guys. Leave me a comment um, letting me know if you have one and how it works for you because somebody was suggesting that to me and I was like, oh, what even is it? 
So I had to kind of, um, I'm gonna leave it open because like I said, I'm gonna work until nine. Well, like I said in my weekly, I'm gonna work till nine. And um, of course, I'm not gonna be working as soon as I get into the carpool. Like that's when I stop, but then I go back again um, once we get back. So let me mark that adequately. And um, let me grab another script. Oh gosh. I feel like, I don't know. Hopefully, if this is your first video, please know that um, for some reason I'm having an off moment. And I don't even want to say an off day because my weekly plan with me was quite nice. Or at least I think it was. So, um, okay. Let me try and find my work scripts because they're hiding from me. Uh-huh, here they are. And I'm gonna be using the larger ones on my daily. I'm saving the smaller ones for my weekly. And once I'm done with the larger ones, I'm just gonna continue using these also for my, um, for my weeklies. And then, like I said, I just go ahead and um, add this little arrow because it's going to continue down. Oops. It's going to continue down a little bit further. And for gymnastics, I'm going to go ahead and kind of do the same, but... Okay, perfect. Now I only need a script for my Etsy here. And these are further down. I've seen it. I just don't know where it ended up be going. Um, I know I have some, here they are. These were older scripts that I used to have in the shop. Um, I just didn't sell them and kept them for myself. So I took down the listings is what I mean um, and kept them for myself because I realized that I was using um, certain words and I don't wanna you know, get blocked or anything. So I just use them for myself. So yeah, um, okay, let me see. Um, I'm not feeling okay with these um, transparent guys here like this. I, I don't think they look cute um, if they were directly onto the page, but given that they're on top of washi, I don't think it looks that nice. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna um, put this little box here and then put them in the box. So that I think is gonna look much better. And I'm sure you'll agree with me once you see them placed on here. Yes, I like this much better um, than the way I had them before. So here we go, here it is. Um, this was a longer video than it had to be. I, it doesn't take me so long to just set up one page. I, I was just like a little bit all over the place. Um, but having this one done, I'm just gonna go ahead and finish the rest off camera, of course. Um, maybe if I do this right now and before I edit the video, then I'll just do a flip through um, showing you the rest of the pages. But for right now, um, this is what I have and this is what Monday looks like on my daily view. I promised you a flip through. So this is Monday, which I planned with you guys on camera. And 
it took me a while um, to set this up, but it's all, it always takes me a while to set up my daily with the type of format that I like to use. But I typically do that watching TV, so um, this is kind of like some me time as well. And I thoroughly enjoy it. So as you can see, my AM routine now, it's a checkbox. It's not the whole routine because I have it listed here. And I did not continue adding the social media icons over here. I might do that when I'm doing it, but I know what it's for. So I don't necessarily need to label all the sections. I basically did this because I was going to flip through it with you guys, but I typically don't label them. I know what goes on each section. Um, so yeah, I had fun. I did have an oopsie uh, washi, extra washi sheet. So I made use of it just to kind of, um, you know, use this washi from one place to another. I could have totally just grabbed a sheet of washi from the weekly kits as well, or grab the washi that did come with this kit and mix and match guys, because what I feel, let me just show you. What I feel you can always do um, with the deco stickers is mix and match. And um, I'm going through because I know I have um, more of the weekly stickers. Let me let me check through my... This is the pile of stickers that I need to put away, as you can see. Um, and I know... Oh, gosh. I'm making a mess. I know I have um, more of these. I just maybe didn't print... Um, oh, I only printed and cut date covers, it seems. I don't know. Um, what did I do here? Let me just put this back and check. Yeah, it seems like I didn't print and cut everything. Um, so I won't be able to show you. But anyway, um, you could always, right, um, just grab maybe this sheet and the washi sheet and complement with some of the deco sticker sheets when there's a coordinating kit that goes with it. Um, that's not always the case, but when it is, you can definitely um, go ahead and do that. And I do let you guys know when there is a coordinating kit for it. So hopefully um, you've been able, I don't wanna mess this up, sorry. So hopefully you've been able um, to see that when I create the listings and this looks super cute and like i said this does not have yellow but it was an oopsie sheet and you can tell that the printer didn't quite print the green that printer is kind of crazy that way um it does its own thing um i messed up the sticker i think i smudged it with something else but it's okay so anyway, um, this is what it looks like. And I think it came out super cute. Again, just a checkbox for the AM routine. And I love these little flags to make this pop up so I don't forget about it. And I used the washi and then some deco here to kind of um, make it look cuter. Oh, you can tell that um, I was tired when I was doing that. It, it was late at night. Um, so <laughs> I was laying stuff down all crooked and... <laughs> and remember, like I told you once, um, when you're working with permanent adhesive, it's not the easiest to um, reposition um, if not done right away. So you do have to be mindful of that. Otherwise, get repositionable adhesive. You just need to leave me a note to seller in my shop and I do that for you. So, um, look at the crooked here. Guys, I was tired. It was dark. Mostly it's because it was dark and I couldn't quite see what I was doing, but this is just horrible. I'm going to have to fix that. That is just not something I'm going to be able to live with. I, I even feel bad showing that to you guys. And it's kind of funny at the same time. And I promise you, I had not, I was not even drinking. I didn't even have a glass of wine. I was just tired and exhausted. So, <laughs> this is not me driving under the influence, you know, so <laughs> that is so funny, guys. So anyway, let's just not finish with this page open here. Let's get a prettier one like this one. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Take care and have a wonderful rest of your week. Bye, everybody.
Okay, so thank you guys so much for watching. I really, really appreciate you guys taking the time to uh, bear with me <laughs> during this video. Thank you so much. Take care and have a wonderful rest of your week. Bye, everybody.